Hi everyone, it's Natalie from NellyDesign.com. Just a short video to show you the new option of Design Space version 7.7. .7. It is the guide feature and I'm very excited about it because who doesn't need a good guide? We always make guides. I know I always make them. So I just want to show you, let's say you have a plank, a wood plank or whatever it is you want. I usually draw the exact size of my blank, whatever blank it is. So let's say it's a wood plank. Well, I will take a square and unlock it and then try to find the, the size of my wood plank. Let's say it's 13 by 5. Why not? So I write it down like this. And now I have my wood plank. If I want to write on it, well, I usually turn the color to white because I really want to see what I'm doing. Well, now there's a new feature in Design Space that is called Guide. So you just go and do in the menu operation and you select Guide. So this is pretty cool because if I want to write text on it, so let's just leave it like that. When I hit Make It, the guide won't transfer to the prepare mat. So you only have your text. You don't need to close the eye of the layer. It's just like it's not there for design space. So that's pretty awesome. The other very cool thing you can do with it is that you can also transform text to guide. So let's say you want to leave yourself a note. You can write, the, I don't know, um, let's say, don't forget to mirror. <laughs> it never happens. <laughs> So you want to leave yourself a note like that. You're going to come here and click guide and the text can also become a guide. So when you hit make it, it won't appear. So now you see that the button make it is, is grayed out. It's because there's nothing on my Canva. Design, design space doesn't recognize this as objects on the Canva. So you won't have the make it option. But I want to show you, I did a project on a mug on my last video and I thought I showed you this. This is a file I made in Design Space that is available to you. And in this video, I told you that there were three pens that were missing in the drop down menu. Well, now I'm able to write it right in the file. So you have it here for the missing colors in the drop down menu when prompt by Design Space to load this pen, then take this pen. So when you're prompt to load, light green, load the lime green pen in your Cricut. So you have everything written down right here. And when you hit make it, well, just the, the, the mug design is there, the, the text is not there. So that is pretty awesome. If you wanna see this video, if you missed it, uh, I will link to it right here so you can watch it. See you later, bye-bye.